This one is that time me and my son danced in the living room to Minor Threat. Stick with that. I'm old as hell, but my kids are not. I had kids very late. I have a what are now a 12-year-old and an 8-year-old son. When you have children, they are not born with good musical taste. You want them to listen, to, to like what you, you like, but if you tell them something is good, that is not good. It, it turns it bad. For a couple years, I, I had to listen to a lot of Katy Perry and Taylor Swift and Avril Lavigne, who are all, I, I understand their genius. I'm far too old for them, but yes, I, I do appreciate their genius, but I wish I didn't have to hear their genius. I didn't try to force stuff on them. I had tried to, you know, playing stuff around the house that would, that would maybe sway them, and it, I never saw any sign. And then one day, I'm cleaning the house, and my house cleaning music has always been Husker Du, the Minneapolis band from the 80s. I have the Pandora Husker Du channel on, and Pandora, there are geniuses behind that. They know what I want to hear. And the song Minor Threat by the band Minor Threat comes on, I look in the back room, and there's my son who's nine years old at the time. He's back there, and he's banging his head very organically, you know, like he doesn't know what I'm doing or anything. And I see this, turn off the vacuum, I yell, Eddie, get in here, get in here and dance with me. And he comes in and I'm on the, on the rug that I had been vacuuming, the vacuum's thrown aside and we danced to minor threat. And as we're dancing, uh, I'm, thank God there's not video of, the, of this scene because I can only imagine how God awful it would look. <laughs> the moves were not what was important to me. The moment was wonderful. Those of you who, uh, who, are, who are saps like me and have kids have had these moments. I, I literally was thinking in the moment, life can only be so good and this is that good. About a month later, I was at Fort Reno in DC, which is the, the home of the DC punk scene through the years. It's a wonderful community vibe to these, these concerts. And there's Ian Mackay, the brains behind Minor Threat. And I go up and I stopped him and made him listen to this story that me and my boy danced to Minor Threat in the living room. And I, 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 uh, I didn't cry for him that time, but I, I thanked him for giving me the hallmark moment. Thanks, Ian.